A third in a series of civil lawsuits against the Jehovah's Witnesses is happening right here. A New Mexico woman says she was sexually abused by one of the church officials when she was a child. New at 10, Action 7 News reporter Laura Terrain joins us with the details. And the lawsuit says the church official raped this woman's mother and also sexually assaulted the woman herself when she was just eight years old and a member of the congregation in Las Lunas. A small church in a small town in New Mexico is now part of a major lawsuit. Lawyers representing a 35-year-old woman say she was just eight years old when she was sexually abused by a leader of the Los Lunas Congregation of the Jehovah's Witnesses. The alleged abuse happened at the church elder's home in 1987 while he was supposed to be taking care of the young girl. Even more disturbing, the complaint alleges this woman's mother was raped by the same leader when she too was eight years old. In both cases, his lawyers say when alerted, the church leaders didn't investigate and didn't remove this church official from his position. And now at 35 years old, this woman's lawyers say she has suffered great pain and emotional distress requiring medical and psychological treatment. Lawyers add that there's a disturbing trend of victims coming forward to tell their stories about sexual abuse within Jehovah's Witnesses congregations. And they say there's an alarming tolerance for abusers of children within the religion. This law firm has also filed two similar lawsuits against Jehovah's Witnesses congregations in San Diego and in Ohio. Lawyers for the alleged victim say she will come forward and identify herself at a press conference tomorrow. Stay with Action 7 News for those updates.